What's up, everyone? This is the Destroyer 229, and welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft. Now, last time, I showed you guys a little bit of progress and a bit of a sneak preview as to what our future adventures might be after the rail carts, because it wasn't quite finished yet. In this episode, the rail cart has been finished! And I put a small aesthetic change by adding a pumpkin on top. Now, I haven't quite tested to see if this was completely 1,000 blocks or a kilometer or whatever, because I wanted to actually show the achievement on screen, so... Fingers crossed. But, yeah, we're going to see and go to Pumcopia. Yes, that is the name of this new found place. Now, I would like to apologize a little bit. I know that my uploading this hasn't been the most, I guess, stable. I have been rather busy over the break, and with just this long project that I've been trying to do with Minecraft, just getting this minecart done, I fell into procrastination. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a college student. What can you expect? But what else can you expect when you get, like, four games for Christmas, two of which are long RPGs? That's also... That can also kind of push things. So I do apologize, this was entirely my fault. I'm going to try to focus more on Minecraft more. Especially since I'm going back to school rather soon. So yeah, I'll have more time to focus on this. I believe I see an Enderman under the water. Yes, you heard me right. You, you heard it here, folks. Ah. But yeah. At the very least, though, with this complete, you will see exactly how far I had to traverse. Once again, going through the mountain, we are approaching where we ended last time. We ended right there. So now you get to see brand new rail cart action as we make our way into yet another mountain. This one was a full-blown cave. The top part is exposed, so yeah, I had to deal with monsters there. A little bit of a problem, but nothing I couldn't handle. And yet more water, and eventually... We will see the end. Man, this stretched out longer than I thought. Ah, lots of expansion and on a rail! Ha ha ha! Just barely, jeez. Oh god, no, 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 you are my ticket back, you're my ticket back, get back here, get back here, no, 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 no. Oh dear, that could have been bad. But yes, this is where our minecart ended. Coincidentally, pretty much at the other end of the continent here, of Pumpcopia. Now you can also see I made a little bit of a bridge over here. Because this is where I'm planning to set up a new, I wouldn't necessarily call it a house, but a new base of operations. Again, oceanside view and everything. This is going to be awesome. But yeah, this is where I'm planning on kind of building yet another house, I would assume. It's not going to be as big and not a lot of time is going to be spent on it. But a house it shall be. Also, I brought another wreck. Right. I forgot. I was going to build a station right there. Kind of why I had some platforms out. Oh, well. Now, I'm not going to necessarily spend a whole lot of time on camera doing this. I will be just building up a simple setup. Just so that I can get... Some sort of foundation. Some sort of safe place for my travels. So that I can just come back here. Put stuff away and then make my way back via minecart. 
to my actual home. So this really is more of a temporary spot more than anything. But yeah. Bit of work is going to have to be done in order to damn it. In order to actually make this a sort of setup. And I do have a few things that I want to do here. So that way I can build some more get some more supplies. Nothing in the way of animals, mind you. More just plant life, which is why I brought some seeds, some saplings, and did I seriously put them? I think I totally put those away. I brought sugar cane with me, but I guess I put them away before I started the episode. How silly of me. All right. Flashbacks to like episode two or even episode one. Uh, just building wooden planks on top of my house. Actually, I'm going to be smarter this time and get up here and do three and four. This should be high enough. Also, this is why I got a full inventory of wood so that I can do this. Still, I do need to be careful so that I can get this done before night falls because I would like to have a roof over my head. And not have to deal with freaking monsters. Because the last thing I want to have to deal with are monsters. When I set up a new base of operations. Yes, I'm basically calling this a base of operations instead of a home. A base of operations. With an awesome oceanside view. Glorious. Simply, oh. Glorious. Glorious. Wow, I need a lot more wood. Also, why'd I do that? Do, 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 do. I promise we'll get some exploration done. I just need to establish a base. I'm actually in a lot better position than when I was when I first played because I only had like half a day and then I had to improvise because night was falling. I think it's afternoon right now, but I should be okay. I'm a lot more experienced, and I even have some armor. I should be all right. Do do do. When am I going to hit the back of this thing? Right now. We. Wow, I actually didn't hurt myself. Go me. Alrighty then. What am I doing? What am I doing? It's like I forgot how to play this game. I didn't forget how to play, I swear. I just need to put a roof over my head. There. I also need more wood. Da -da 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 -da. That should be enough. I should at least be able to get a roof. And my next priority will be doors and torches, but I have plenty of torches, mostly for exploration, but also for this special occasion of lighting my freaking house or base of operations. I'm going to use those interchangeably for this place, so don't be surprised. Do, 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 It'd help if I move the right way. And with this, I'm encased in darkness. I'm surprised that flower is still there. Alrighty then. And we are good to go, I suppose. We need more light in this place. There. Now I just need to make... Oh, wait a minute. I have a crafting table. There it is. I can go ahead and place a crafting table here. Crafting table. And... Door! I only need a single door here. Oh, I think it is starting to get dark. 
Mm. Oh, yeah. It's starting to get dark, so... It would be a good time to simply put in a door. I also need to get myself a new bed. Oh, well. Bed. I also would like a furnace. It should have the kind of some of the comforts of home, but not everything. And then the chest. This will be where I will put all of my stuff that I explore here in Pumpcopia. That I can then transfer back home whenever I need to. So, first thing in the morning, we will explore, officially explore, Pumpcopia. We will now begin the exploration of Pumpcopia. I seriously hope a creeper doesn't come up behind me. Yay! So yeah, this was basically kind of the edge of the map. At least of this kind of continent. So I do feel like I have to make my way back. There is plenty of space here though. So that actually does make putting some stuff here nice. That is oddly... It's somewhat convenient, but also not convenient. It's convenient because... Yay, sugarcane. It's not because I would keep it here. But it's a, just a tad too far away. So as soon as we return to our base of operations, we should be fine. I probably also shouldn't explore too far out until I get another bed. Because I'm going to have to stay up all night. I also probably shouldn't stray too far away. Because... Hmm. Well, technically I can put place markers. I do have the cobblestone, and I also have the uh, torches for it. As well as some wood for sticks and uh, a little bit of coal. So I do have the means of putting place markers, and I think I'll go ahead and explore that little island over there. It's a desert. As we all know, deserts are filled with goodies. Pyramids, villages, so things should work out well, or not. They may not. They may work terribly. Who knows? All right, onwards. It looks like the desert immediately ends and goes into a snow biome. I think I have an alternative name for this place. Though, I don't believe it would go quite well. Okay. There's apparently a cave nearby. Do, 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 do. Exploring Pumpcopia. Yay, 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 yay. Cows, yay, yay. All right. I suppose we'll just... Hmm. There's a few ways we can go. Let me see if there's anything out this way. Hugging the desert. I'll see if there's anything out this way before I return to the place markers. And it just kind of keeps stretching. Hmm. It's possible. It ends. Or does it? Zombies? You don't scare me, zombies. Yeah, it just kind of hugs this place, so... Oh, don't tell me it's starting to get dark already. I think it is. Hmm. I know we're kind of at the cusp of an episode length. But I do want to explore some more of this wonderful place. Perhaps find more pumpkins. After all, it is called Pumpcopia. Alright. Well, at any rate, we can continue onward this way. I don't feel bad going forward just a bit more. Alright, so torch there, torch there, torch there. We move onwards. That's something you don't see every day. 
Okay, now he's on fire. There we go. Zombies somehow spawned or got here or something. And yet he was smart enough to not leave the area. And then he saw me and then lost all sense of any sort of knowledge. And then killed himself. Because zombies are dumb like that. Alright, some more cows. Mm-hmm. Certainly hope there's something interesting we can find here. I think I see the lava that I was here. No, those are mushrooms. That isn't lava. They look like lava from a distance. No, they are simply mushrooms. Interesting. I'm looking at a little mushroom I have on my desk right now. It's a Mario mushroom. Da 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 da. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> You guys don't need me to sing the Mario theme. Anyone can do it. Well, most people can. It is starting to light up the place. At the very least, this is convenient way to get down. Which means it'll be convenient to get back up. I also think I'm starting to stray a bit far. It could possibly be because of... The forest, but at the same time, ooh, some wolves. Unfortunately, I have no bones to give you. That reminds me of that pack of like 17 wolves we found earlier. Oh, just a small family of four. Don't mind me, little wolves. All right, we are, we've now encountered sheep. Oh, it's another pack of wolves. Oh, we are in a snow bomb. What the? Thank you, wolves. I appreciate your gift. Wow, they really do not like sheep. You had beef with that sheep. But I thank you for the wool. I will use it to construct a bed. Too bad I don't have a crafting table on me right now. Oh, well. I can do that when I get back. Uh, where was my last place marker? I kind of got distracted. Wasn't it by the last family of wolves? I thought it was by the last family of wolves. Where is it? Place marker. There it is. Yeah, it's kind of close to this pack of wolves. So, I guess we'll put this one by the next pack of wolves, and I suppose we can just call it an episode. Really not that much, but at the very least, we got us an achievement. Finally got on our rails, and we can explore this new place called Pumpcopia. I gotta make up some names. Something to call this place. And originality, when it comes to names, is not my forte. I have a pretty imaginative mind, but when it comes to names, I blank. Like, I can think of things for, like, characters or plot or something like that. In fact, I kind of have a bit of a story go going, but that's a tale for another time. But when it comes to names, it's a bit lackluster, I will admit mm -hmm. that. I'm terrible at making up names. <sighs> Hence why I don't regularly nickname my Pokemon in games, ever. But that will do it here. So, as we are making our way back to our base of operations, next time on Let's Play Minecraft, we will continue exploring Pumpcopia in this general direction. Uh, but I suppose we can make a few more furnishings to our house. We need to create a bed. A furnace would actually be nice as well. But I can very easily do that off screen. It doesn't take that much effort or cobblestone. So I'll go ahead and do some of that stuff off screen. I think I'll try to save m some of the planting stuff and like crops for the beginning of next time. And then we can skip on ahead for more exploration. So as I make my way back to the base... 
Until next time, everyone. Where the heck's my base? Is it this way? Oh no, I am lost! Yeah, it's right here. I s thought I had some sticks. Now, oh, well, I need to make place markers there so that I can remember where to go. That could be helpful. I want to get the base in view. Damn it! Base, base, base of operations. There it is. Man, this is gonna require some work. So until next time, everyone. Take care.